Hi there, you okay? Oh great, great. Listen to this. I just found out something crazy today. I was able to find the names of the previous owners of that house. Apparently the people who used to live there were the McCroy family. Specifically one child and Mr. and Mrs. McCroy. Hmm. Can't say I ever heard of them. Uh, anyway, you're in the small bedroom tonight, huh? Well, that's both good and bad. While our crew was searching around the house, one of our employees found this handy little gadget that allows the pad to flicker the lights in any room in the house. Use this mechanism to your advantage. Plug the cord into the pad. Oh, you already did. Great. To flicker the lights, you can't just press the button once. You have to repeatedly tap the button over and over. Flicker the lights in a room a ghost is in, they will for sure be scared away. But if they enter the bedroom, you've got nothing to do. But wait, wait. I got it. The alarm clock. Yes, there's a freaking loud alarm clock in that room. And if the clock strikes when a ghost is in your room, a loud annoying noise will drive them away. Alright, then. Uh, hey, just curious. Did you inhale any smoke from last night? Oh. Oh dear, you know that probably wasn't the best idea, right? Well, if the smoke from last night starts messing with your head and you see something crazy in front of you, just remember eye contact, man. Pull up the camera and pretend you don't see anything. Be very careful.
<laughs> Surprise! Oh, you weren't expected to be in a situation like this now, were you? <laughs> oh, how far you've come! You better not slip up like you did by entering this house. Oh, don't worry. You're only in the most open and vulnerable place in the entire house. We've been watching you. You know that, right? And let me ask you this. Could you perhaps be... the one? The one that caused us so much pain? <laughs> you just made our job a whole lot easier. Hunting you down inside a place like this will be a piece of cake. Let us find out... now! Fowie, you've been there for a while now. Sorry about the late call, phone line's been acting funny lately, and concentrating on work isn't easy with the police cars active and such. Anyway, tell me where you are tonight. What? what's that? <laughs> the hallway! <laughs> oh, oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Which room did you really hide in? <laughs> you hid in the hallway, didn't you? Oh no! What were you thinking, man? The hallway is so large and open! There's nearly seven ways to get in there. All right, wait. Hear me very carefully. Oh, there should be a coat rack in there, correct? Oh, thank God. Now, the main form of defense in there will be disguise. If you see a ghost near you or somewhere around you, wear the color coat that matches their own clothes. And look away. For example, if someone wearing green clothes were to enter the hallway, put on a green coat and look away from them until they are gone. Got it? They can also sneak behind from the laundry room. If that's the case, just wear the colored coat and shake left to right. Maybe shaking your head like that will make the ghost afraid of you? But then there's the very front of the hall, oh dear. Well, there are two rooms that connect to the front of there, so if you see a ghost in either of those two rooms, the game room and old bedroom I believe, stare at them on the camera until they go away. Got it? Good. Stay safe and do the best you can in there.